story was done about me and my family on the 22nd of April last year. And I asked, not for sympathy, for I asked for people to help me with information in respect to what the banks were truly doing. I asked for solicitors, barristers, judges to help me anonymously. And I got a tremendous response from people. I got information that clearly showed not the soft words that are being used for the last four years of reckless or negligent or careless lending. I got words of criminality, laws being broken. And as every person knows, when a law is broken, a victim is created. The, unfortunately, the victims are our countrymen, is this nation of people who are suffering because of criminal acts. Today, for the first time in the history of the state, I have brought a criminal action against a regulated entity, the banks. Um, if you operate without a license, if you operate against our country to legislation, you've broken the laws. And all I'm asking today for the first time is for that to be addressed, for the banks to be addressed the issue of what they've done and rectify and give every person an opportunity now who looks tonight at their pay packet and considers whether or not they're going to survive for the next six days till the next one or who are going to look at the possibility, as I have, at a bailiff or a sheriff coming out to drag you out of your home. It is time today to put aside the blame game and focus solely on those who broke the laws of this country. And when you break a law, it's a criminal act.